All right, our next stop is 5821. This is a car that was built uh, around 1924 for Boston, Massachusetts. The Boston Elevated Railway Company it was called. And they had a very, very large fleet of these cars, and they were known as the Type 5. Boston decided to call their cars by type because it was a design just for their city only. But most cities were like that back in the day. Other cities didn't call their cars types, but like, take a look at that car right there from Chicago. There's no other car in our collection here that looks like that car. So a lot of these cities had cars that were designed just for them and them only. But Boston called them types. Now, this car here ran in Boston until 1959, and in the 1940s, a gentleman was running for office of mayor in Boston. And at that time period, in the 1940s, the Boston Elevated Railway was threatening to raise the fare from a nickel to a dime. And this guy wrote a poem to help his election possibilities, saying in his poem, if you vote for me, I'll keep them from raising the fare. Well, a band about 10 years later in the 50s got their hands on that poem and they wrote a song. And today, if you live in Boston, you have a, a Charlie card. He wrote, they wrote the song Charlie on the MTA, the Kingston Trio. So was Charlie stuck on this car underneath the streets of Boston? We don't know. She does have a twin sister that sits today at Boylston Street Station in Boston. That car also belongs to the Seashore Trolling Museum, but it's on permanent display behind the fence at Boylston Street Station in Boston, which, by the way, is the oldest subway station in America. From Boylston Street Station to Park Street Station was constructed in 1897 and opened up on September 1st, so it's 115 years old, those two stations.